Hello viewers. Today we are going to see about the banana leaf bath. My 11 year old son is going to uh, practice this. I'll show you the live demo. Banana leaf bath or plantain leaf bath has so many benefits. There are some rules we need to follow. Uh, first of all, it should be a sunny day. The sun should have raised well and uh, probably it's around now it's around 8:30 a.m. the morning. It's the best time uh, to practice this. And whoever practicing it should be on an empty stomach. Before practicing it, the practitioner has to drink a lot of water, at least three to four glasses of water. I'll show you the live demo now. First, we should spread the mat like this uh, under the direct influence of the sun. It could be any bed sheet or cotton bed sheet, thick bed sheet, something like that. Okay. Then let's put the rope like this. So the using these ropes, we are going to tie up the banana leaves. Okay. After that, just spread the banana leaf so that the top portion is on the top side. I have around 10 banana leaves. If you have bigger banana leaves, maybe few or lesser will be sufficient. Okay. So after spread it like this, you can ask the child to uh, remove the dresses. It could be as minimum as possible. And then he has to drink a lot of water. Okay. Just before the practice, it's better to have um, around two glasses of water. Now ask your child to sit like this. Uh, this is very important. You need to cover the head with the wet cloth. Squeeze it and then surround it. Surround the head with the wet cloth and just ask him to sleep like this. And then start closing the leaves like this. You, you can open small holes for breathing purpose. And then tie it like this. After covering, keep some holes for a breathing and if the person is getting fear, you can open for eyes as well, little bit opening on the top. So then tie the knots like this completely all over the body and leave it for around 30 minutes, 30 to 40 minutes. Make sure the whole body is covered without any gaps. Be with the child for about some 20 to 30 minutes. If really not able to Continue, you can quit any time. Just note on the time and uh, leave it. See, there are a lot of benefits. The antioxidants present in the banana leaves, such as polyphenol, which actually uh, get absorbed by the skin. And the water he drank just before the therapy gets uh, comes out through the skin pores and opens up the skin, skin pores. Uh, that's a part of a cleansing. So after this bath, what need to be done? After carefully removing the banana leaves, this is very important, you should dump it somewhere so that none of the cattle can consume it. it since it is little poisonous, it should not be consumed by any animals or something like that. So please carefully dump this somewhere outside. The child has to be on shadow for some 15 minutes once he gets up from this uh, therapy. After 15 minutes, he can take a bath, uh, not in a very hot water, not in a very cold water, warm water. Okay. After that, after 15 minutes of break of the bath, he can start consuming the breakfast or whatever. This therapy rejuvenates the cells, organs and the total organ system. It completely removes the waste by cleansing uh, through the sweating of the skin. See, the plantain leaf consists of some natural beneficial antioxidants such as polyphenol, which gets absorbed by the body completely. Through the excessive sweating, it removes the waste of the body. It's the best way of cleansing. The pores in the skin gets open up and the body is able to breathe fully. And also, the immune system of the complete body is recharged like anything and it's ready to fight against any ailments. Okay, once the time is up, you can remove all the banana leaves. Okay. Now, all these used banana leaves have to be carefully disposed. Remember that these are little poisonous now and none of the cattle should consume this. So, carefully dump this somewhere outside the city. After the therapy, the kid can rest under the shadow for about some 15 minutes and drink some water if needed. Thank you.